So I was watching Canel Joseph's latest video and some absolute bullshit happened. Uh, some homophobic assault fucking happened. So he played, I would call, I would consider a harmless prank. You know, there's a viral TikTok or Facebook reel, something, some kind of video, right? I, I believe it's a joke. I'm not sure. But a barber bites like his client's lip. Uh, it was a guy on guy, right? And he shows it to the guy. He said, hey, can you can you give me the service? And so he kicks him out of his shop, right? He, the barber kicks Canel out of his shop. And then this is what happens directly after. And I feel like it's complete bullshit. So I'm going to mute my mic and uh, I'll go ahead and play it for y'all. Issue, why are you snitching? I want to report you to the pump. Stop, stop, don't, you can't assault us. Get the fuck out of here. What are you doing? You. Oh get shit. You better get the fuck out of here. Why are you trying to touch me? I'm gonna kick your ass right now. Oh, whoa, 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 oh, whoa. whoa. You're like pressing on, stop. Get the fuck out of here. Stop, stop, stop. Fucking little faggot motherfucker. <laughs> You're a little girl, man. Don't! I got a warrant. So I don't know what he did. The other guy was filming us and he basically just ripped Barry's door open. I'm not gonna lie, I owe you a new door. So yeah, as you can see, they did so much fucking harm to themselves and to their property in like what appears to be two minutes or less. So the barber who initially rejected him getting his haircut, you know, who he played the prank on, went to go grab a damn barber's knife. You know, the ones where they cut your face, you know, they, the razor, that's what that's what I meant to say, the razor that they shave your face with. He was about to attack him just for asking him that stupid, funny ass question, right? I feel like that was completely harmless. Like, what's up with the fucking overreaction? Like... What's up with that? And then he called him the F slur too. Uh, I don't. I don't think that was the guy who kicked him out. It was the other guy, the random dude in the red shirt that did that and said that. So you can see the title of the barbershop in the video. I did actually go to the Google page, and people are already flooding it with one star reviews, which is what I think. You all should do, whoever watches this video, y'all should go do it too. Flood that fucking barbershop with one-star reviews. Call them violent and homophobic because that's exactly what they were over a dumb little funny joke. You know, he didn't he didn't touch them at all. They were over there trying to beat his ass for, for words and showing them like a little harmless video. Like, who who does that? Who does that shit? Especially seeing the cameraman. Like, you could see he's recording it. Why would you have yourself caught on video, like I said, being homophobic and then threatening to cut somebody with a damn razor? But I had to share this. I had to uh, employ you if you watch this also. Go leave them some damn one-star funny-ass reviews because they deserve it. Like, they overreacted over a small, harmless prank. Nobody got hurt. They just showed them a five to ten second clip and said some crazy shit they didn't even say they didn't even curse or anything there was no derogatory language he was just asking a silly question playing a silly prank and he borderline fucking assaulted him and then he broke his damn uh car handle uh they did call the police i'm not sure what happened after that they didn't really uh well i don't know if i watched it honestly <laughs> as soon as i saw that i was okay i gotta make a video like that's just fucking insane I really do hate living in Texas sometimes just because of people like that overreacting over small, harmless shit. Uh, let me know what you think. Let me know if somehow that was justified. I don't see any reason or or possible way that that was justified their actions. But let me know. Let me know what you think. It was, it was crazy. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.